Hello everybody. It is very laid out, so sorry if I'm going to be a little quiet. However, I am going to be reacting to the second part of Trump, Biden, and Obama uh, making a tier list of finance and phrase characters. I really enjoyed the first one. There were a few questionable jokes in there, but uh, I, I think I could put that aside for this because I am curious to see how they're going to uh, rate the rest of the videos. Characters. Without further ado, let's get into this. Alrighty, here it is. Link in the description below, all that good stuff. So without further ado, let's do this thing in three, two, one. Alrighty, gentlemen, who's up for round two? I like the business. Honestly, I'd much rather just get this furry shit over with right now, so I think that's <laughs> a pocket gamer idea. <laughs> Alright, you good <clears> with <throat> this too, Joe? Joe? He's asleep, isn't he? Oh, fuck me, he fell the fuck asleep. How original? Yes. Holy, Holy shit, shit, a 13-year-old girl. girl. Huh? What? Where? No. Let me smell them. We're ranking the animatronic furries again, Sleepy Joe. Get your Adderall in your blood and help us. Well, that's fucking fine. Also, Yuck. don't question what I just said. Well, we're obviously starting with the fourth the game, so we got doing. Nightmare Freddy up first. I respect Nightmare Freddy me. solely because he's a better <clears throat> father than Donald ever will be. Shut Damn. the fuck up, Sleepy Joe. Last time I checked, Hunter is still fucking dying half of the time. God, we get it. You guys are shit fathers. Anyway, Nightmare Fair. Fred's design goes pretty hard, and his true. voice goes hard true. as well. It's true. I Even though he hasn't he seen much in the fourth game, I think his mechanic and design alone gives him A tier. Freddles are pretty annoying, though. I hate their stupid little screeches. But they're so cute. The Freddles are so cute. Yeah, sounds like Darth Vader. Vader. All right, all right, fair enough. We'll throw him in B tier then. Next is Nightmare. Hey, Bob. I was right. Why doesn't he have a voice oh, yet? Hey, that's actually a good point, Joe. Some, Why the fuck? Does look, sometimes the f characters not having voices were better because it made him scarier. I don't know. But that's just me. Doesn't he have a voice? <clears throat> he definitely benefit from a voice, but that doesn't change the fact that he's one of the more lamer nightmares. He's still neat and all, but I don't think he should get any higher than B tier. There's just okay, nothing really interesting about him, unlike the other nightmares. Mid Bonnie. All right, Mid Bonnie. <laughs> what about Nightmare Chica? Ooh, oh, Nightmare Cupcake cool. is such a neat idea. Yeah, don't ever brilliant. fucking ooh again, Sleepy Joe. But besides, the Nightmare Cupcake is fucking annoying. It's so but, easy to die to it in the fourth game. Sounds like a big... But that's the point of Finance of Phrase, is for it to be difficult, because the more you die from a character, that means that's the... Big skill issue. Yeah, Don sounds like a fat fucking skill issue. Anyways, <laughs> Nightmare Chica is pretty neat skill and definitely issue. one of the more scary nightmares. <laughs> I agree. Especially with those three rows of teeth. And God also damn. in Ultimate Did you Custom forget Obama? Closing. They scrapped the three rows. She only has two now. Same with Jacko Chica. Oh, and Foxy's oh, really? Well, that just makes her more mid then. Mid Nightmare put the chicken in B with the rest of them. All right, and what about the goat, Nightmare Foxy? Rest in peace, Tongue. We will yeah. forever miss you. Right? The yeah, I think Foxy is, so is the cool. coolest of the main four and nightmares. They kept the tongue. But I tell so you, cool. he would be yes if he kept that sick-ass tongue. What the fuck, Scott? He still is epic, though, because he is a Foxy, so I think he should get the first A of this video. True, he is still a dope Foxy's Foxy variant at the end of the day. I'm sorry. I cheer for Nightmare Foxy. Now we're on to Nightmare Fredbear. Easy S. Yes. My normal Golden Freddy bias know. would argue F, but this can slide because Nightmare Fredbear is pretty dope. Yeah. Not to mention he was I'd basically the first S, boss though. fight Not in the series. Fredbear. The fifth night is tight. All right, I think we're all in agreement on S tier, right? Yeah, put him in S. I'm okay yeah, with S, no I guess. no B tier. Go for B tier. And why the fuck should we Donald? He still reminds me of Golden Freddy at the end of the day, so Agreed. that brings him down. Agreed. Oh, my fucking Lord, man. Stop this Golden Graham hate right now. You're but seriously molding he's Trumpy. Don't call me. He's very overrated nowadays. Golden Freddy, Foxy, like all the Spring Trap, all those characters, they're just overrated because they're overused. Hey, Trumpy, you geriatric you need a new story. Oh, my fucking God. Nightmare Fredbear clearly belongs in S, but for Trump's wrinkly sake, we'll only put him in A. That is fair. Still seems rigged, but what the fuck ever. <laughs> all right, gentlemen. Now we're on to Nightmare S himself. S hey, look. Look, he's darker than Not another fucking word out of you, Oompa Loompa looking ass. <laughs> Nightmare is honestly kind of mid. Not only is he just a recolor of Nightmare no. Fredbear, but he's also not really explained too well. <laughs> yeah, the dark man kind of just comes out of nowhere and then leaves. But it's also, creepy. he reminds me of Golden Freddy still. Oh my God, stop speaking ill of the Golden Graham right now, Donnie. Anyways, I do agree that Nightmare is kind of mid, and honestly, I'd be fine putting him in B tier. Okay. Oh, is that because he's Black Obama? Joke, too. Take your fucking meds, you're overdue. Anyways, next is Plush Trap. <laughs> Honestly, he's a pretty plush nice shake-up to I'm the original. Okay, I'm okay with Plush Trap being an S just because he's underused, he's really awesome, and I love the in FNAF world. Core Knights of the fourth game. Um, he's also a nice little throwback to Spring Trap, and he's pretty iconic. 
Uh, and also, I hate mentioning the game's name, but he had a really cool mechanic and special delivery as well. Actually, I, I think that basically sums delivery. it all up. I'd say A tier for plush trap. Yeah, that okay, was a really good description, Donnie. I'm kind of shocked for real. <laughs> I tier for plush trap. I tier. Um, now we're getting into the Halloween characters, starting with Jack Bonnie. Can S, we all just Jack selectively Obani. agree that both Jacko characters are mid and put God them in D it. tier? That's you can put Jack Bonnie in D, but Jack Chica should go in C, at least because of her voice and the pumpkin. All right, then the Jack O mids can go in but D. But Jack Chica does have really cool Next up lines. is Nightmare Mangle. Pretty uh, dope ass design, yeah, and honestly, just a. as good, if not better, than Nightmare Foxy's. Do they have a confirmed gender? No, they don't. C tier, mid C tier, no gender. Oh God, just put them in A tier with Nightmare Foxy Barack. Don, you gotta cool it with that shit. Yeah. Anyways, next Agreed. is Nightmare Balloon Boy. Now, unlike the other Balloon Boys, I think Nightmare, Nightmare, Nightmare on there. is kind of sick. Not gonna lie. <laughs> not to mention how good Matthew <laughs> Curtis's voice is. Agreed. Like, Holy I was just about on. to say that. All right, fine. I'll admit Nightmare BB is probably the best a? of the balloon shit stains. A? We can put him in B tier, uh. although we should probably try and get some other tiers filled since B tier is getting kind of bloated. Sounds good then. All right, the last character for Freddy's 4 is Nightmarion. Nightmarion Pretty dope design awesome. and definitely better than Nightmare for sure. Love Can't forget design. his annoying A-tier. ass mechanic in UCN, A-tier. though. Sleepy Joe out here yeah, actually that's... spitting facts. Yeah, mm. that mechanic was absolute A's. True, yeah, that mechanic did suck giant donkey okay. dick. I was trying to defend it, but I, I remembered that it just fades in, and if you look at it, you die. I, yeah, it's kind of bullshit. All right, then I'm cool with only putting him in B. But... We shouldn't put him in the same tier as Nightmare, because he's better than Nightmare. Fine, then put him in A tier, and we'll call it a low A. All right, good compromise. I like that shit, my patriotic shitheads. <laughs> oh, my God, is it time for Sister Location now? <laughs> oh, Actually, Sister we Location. we from FNAF World to go yes! first. Yes! Oh, God, why is that mid-game even on this tier list? What, shut the fuck up, pussy. Ain't no way this clown is talking shit about FNAF World. Agreed. Fucking fine, just get it over if with. If it came out All nowadays, right, then, first for is the would be huge Mendo the Endo, gotta Mendo say, despite him D. not appearing in any game other than World, he's still pretty neat. I really don't give a fuck about these world characters. Just call me when we get to an actual good game. Shut up, Orange Man. You clearly don't know world. Anyways, Mendo is kind of cool. I just put him in C or B tier. Well, I think Mendo is neat, so I'll give him the B. All right, next up is DD. She's kind of like BB, but somehow worse. F tier. Actually, I am going to comment. Fuck this stupid ass child. She's so fucking annoying in UCN. F tier for real. Once again, I could not have said it better myself. Glad we can all agree on a universal truth. Get in the bin, you stupid child. All right, now we're on to sister location. Yep, and of course we have Circus Baby up first. Definitely a pretty important character. Probably uh, deserves Important, it. yeah, but I'd say... I'd go low A tier for Baby. But we can't forget the know. fact that she did basically jack shit in SL, so I'd say no higher than A. Not only is her voice extremely iconic, but also she's a fan favorite. She's Other almost Masters as recognizable great, as Freddy himself. All right, then. I think Baby belongs in A tier. Next up is Ballora. Okay, Do not say right. a single word, Joe. Fuck you, Barry. Honestly, Ballora is kind of mid, not going to lie. Agreed. Aside from her voice and her gimmick of being blind, there's really yeah. nothing special about her. Yeah, and yeah. compared to the other animatronics in SL, she doesn't stand out nearly as well. I'd say C tier for Ballora. But, yeah, but, but she's so she is pretty. Shut the, the fuck up, up Joe. Joe. Enough with your down badass. She's going in C. <laughs> Moving on to Fun Time Freddy. S tier for certain. I don't want to hear it. This character has one of the S best voices for fun in time all Freddy. fiction. No argument Kellen there. Goff is truly a master at voice acting. Agreed, Not to mention my Freddy's guy. design is super iconic and holds up great to today. Yep. And he has Bonbon bon can't forget that. Oh, yeah. I think we all agree that Hell Fun yeah. Time Freddy is the perfect specimen. Throw him an S or else I'll fucking die. Glad we all agree. Next up is Funtime Foxy. <laughs> Not as good as Freddy, but yeah, still a. pretty iconic. Pretty awesome. He has a good voice awesome. and easily the scariest level in Help Wanted. I'd yeah. comment on his questionable gender, but the joke is already running its course. Just put them in A. I don't care. Glad you know when to stop Donald I tier for Foxy. I Next it's A. <laughs> oh, who gives a shit about yeah, Yendo's so cool. I love Yendo. Actually, the very first figure I ever made when I was a kid was um, uh, like a wire figure, and I made it Yendo from FNAF Sister Location, and it looks great. I have it on my shelf. Character. They're just an Easter egg and a bad one at that. Literally just fun time Freddy's Endo, but with yellow eyes. Shut up and drown it's yourself, cool. Don. Yendo is epic because of his lameness. Besides, he could be a fun time Fredbear Endo, which is cool. He is kind of irrelevant in the grand scheme of things, so just throw him in C tier. All right, then. And how about Lulbit? Lulbit got oh, an Lulbit's upgrade awesome. to an actual Kenny I love character, Lulbit. so they're I really cool want the Lulbit book. plushie. Still, still kind of lame that they're there. just a fun time Foxy reskin, although I but know that Lulbit so is really popular for some S, reason. S. Although I don't really see why. Please. Yeah, they're kind of trash. Co-parter Lulbit fans, put them in C tier Barry. 
Can't right, win then. shit with these and guys. And what about Biddy Bab and Electro Bab? Those little mm, shits haven't see. been a threat since their debut game. See. Not to mention Electro Bab is just a shameless waste of a slot of the SL Custom Night roster. Agreed. Bro, ain't that the truth. I'll just throw both of them in D tier. And while we're at it, throw the mini arenas in F tier. Those little shits are the but reason why Night 4 they're is such creepy a pain as fuck. in the fucking They're ass. creepy as fuck. Also though. the fact that they were another waste on the roster of Custom Night. Min Arena 2, seriously, Scott, where the fuck was Baby and Ennard? Agreed, F tier mini bitches. Speaking of which... Ennard and Baby were in Ultimate Custom Night. Are they talking about Sisilication Custom Night? Because if so, then yeah, I agree with that. We got Ennard? We got an S tier this man? Come on. Yeah, Ennard's design is kind of peak. Yeah, and, and his boss battle in the private room is No tough. argument there. I love Ennard. Even if it Ennard's is harder amazing. than my little Donnie from time to time. Love Can't him. forget about his level and help wanted. Wait, the did he talk about his play? All right, no further objections for Ennard and S. All right, second to last is Bon Bon. Bon Bon eh. isn't really bon bon. anything <laughs> special on his own, but he still has a pretty iconic voice. Yeah, he works True. best when he's with Freddie, but he still is pretty epic. Yeah, eh. I'd say B tier for Bon Bon. Uh, okay, fine. Wait, I thought Bon Bon was a girl. Why the fuck would you ever assume that Sleepy Joe? The character encyclopedia said so. The character encyclopedia also said that Bon Bon was in the third game Joe. It isn't really the best Oof. source of info, so shut up and really? get Really? I've actually roll. never been on the And last but not least, we have Bonnie. Why the fuck does Bonnet's this character so cool. exist? so cool. I have the plush of her. I love her. I love her yeah, so much. Yeah, they're kind of just another shameless recolor that doesn't okay, then have we'll any go interesting see? features or story. Honestly, D or maybe even F tier. They're okay. a little girl, so D tier. Okay, what the fuck, Joe? Just... Because you said that I'm putting them in F tier. Oh, what the fuck? This shit is rigged as fuck. That's, That's my line, line you piece of dog, dog shit. <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> These videos make me laugh and also make me feel a little upset inside. <laughs> I don't know really how to feel. Either way, that was The President's Make a Tier List Part 2. If you guys want part three, please let me know in the comments below. I enjoyed it for the most part. I don't agree with some of their options. However, I do agree with some of their more popular characters besides Foxy. I do their, I do agree with their take on Golden Freddy, though. I will say. They're very overused. Anyways, let me know your guys' opinions and uh, your thoughts in the comments below. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll be able to see you guys in the next video. Mess up that outro. Bye-bye.